Guys, Gunsmith, I'm back with another Lego gun. Uh, I know it's been a while since I've uploaded, but uh, it's because this gun took a while. So here it is. It is the SA-805 from Call of Duty Ghosts. Um, yeah, it's pretty nice color scheme. I'm starting to incorporate, uh, you know, more colors into my guns. And yes, yeah, so here's the mag. It's got the little sticky out bits there, the butt pad. Load straight in just like an M4 lower receiver. Uh, it's got a functioning trigger. A ambidextrous select fire. Let's see, safe and I believe it's semi auto and full auto. It's got the flip up sights. That's pretty cool. Uh, the flash header breaks off a lot. Sorry about that. <clears throat> the stock is foldable. Folds to the right of the gun. It's like so. And it is tiled out along with the rest of the gun. Uh, <clears throat> so I'll give you a look down the sights. You can see there. Really nice sights. I like these a lot. It's got the tactical rails. One on the top. One on the bottom. And one on each side of the handguard. Which is pretty cool. So I'll fold out the stock. So I can show you the charging handle. The one of the rubber bands snapped. So it's not working perfectly right now. But it's also got the uh, hole in it, if you can see there. And I'll show you the ejection port on the other side. See there. You can see the rubber bands in there. So yeah. Um, here's the flash hider. Once again, it broke off. But yeah. Uh, this gun does field strip, which I will show in a second here. I just gotta go get the tool. Sorry about that. I had to go get the tool for the field strip. So I'm gonna start off with removing the sights in the front and the back. Slide out the barrel, just like so, with the sling mount. And there's about three pins, I believe. Two back here and one up here in the front. So I'm just going to remove those with another Technic pin. Um, so yeah. I'm trying to make most of my guns field strip now. Uh, not sure if I'm going to do it on my next gun because it's going to be such a large uh, rifle. It will be the Dragunov semi-automatic sniper rifle, the SVD. So after you take out all these pins, you can remove the entire lower receiver from the upper receiver, just like so. Here's the whole lower receiver. Here's the upper. Nothing really special. And you can also fold the stock better close up of the stock nice butt pad in the back cheek rest all that see so yeah, I'll just reassemble it very quickly I'm going to be taking this apart after this video to start the dragging off um, while I'm rebuilding this I will tell you guys that I may possibly get a job with Lego because uh, one of my neighbors, uh, I showed him this S805 because I know he worked for Lego, and he still does. And he gave me an absolutely massive uh, box of just free bricks, uh, tons of brown, black, and white in there. And then along with, uh, you know, tons of other colors. Um, so 
which I can actually show you real quick. I have it all in a giant bag here. So I got tons of pieces, uh, just mainly for free, pretty much. I mean, I just brought it over. So yeah, but uh, back to the gun. Here it is in its uh, full glory. Just entirely reassembled. So that's basically it for this. I want to thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Please like, favorite, and subscribe if you have enjoyed. And as always, thanks for watching.